time for another day of winter fishing. Uh, we currently have excellent weather for sea trout with uh, quite warm wind and quite strong. It makes the shorelines look awesome. Uh, it's like five degrees plus and thick cloudy sky that almost blends with the horizon. I just have good memories from this. It feels awesome. Although we have one issue and I come to that. Today will be a hunt for the temperature. We only have two degrees in the water here. Well, as fish is cold blooded, having the same temperature as the surrounding water, one thing you can do when the water is very cold is to slow down your retrieve because the fish will be less active. So you can offer them a more simple meal by just slowing down. So we'll see if that is something that will work. But our hope today is to be able to find warmer water at some spot. So we will do a lot of spot jumping today. Check the temperature, hope for a warmer place. Yep. First cast of the changing fly <laughs> and it would be awesome. Oh, I have a double on. There is a double. I have one on a gamarus and one on a orange shrimp. I don't know if the gamarus has the bigger fish. Come on. Double in the cold water, please. Yeah, they're both still on. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Woohoo! I have two! <laughs> oh man, they're so wrapped up. Fly number one. Gamarus, fly number two, a completely inhaled orange bay shrimp. Well, like I said, I thought it was going to be good conditions today. And yes, I'm wearing gloves, but I'm just holding them on my fingertips. Look at that. <laughs> a nice double to start the day and crazy condition. Look at that. <laughs> Is the fish going to be biting today or not? What do you think? Well, it's almost like jinxing it, but it wasn't my first place. Uh, we fished one place before this. Uh, just turned around because the water was two degrees. Came to here. It was two degrees here too, but it just looked too good. We had to try it for more than a little bit. And awesome, to, awesome to hook into these on the Gamarus and the orange space shrimp. But I'm extra happy about the Gamorous fish. I don't know which one it is. Well, the one that is a little bit bigger. <laughs> While I do some untangling here, because this fish made a mess out of my leader. Uh, in the video description, you find links to both these flies that I used, as well as to what gear I'm using. And today's setup is a little bit odd because I am uh, gonna go on a international trip in a, in a few weeks. And uh, before that, I don't wanna break my main rods like the Marisola and the Mary so I'm using a rod that I am uh, not gonna bring which is the Stifu six weight rod but I put on it my favorite sea trout line which is the Vision Vibe 85 plus the floating version in a seven weight 
I only have it in a 7 weight. And I don't care so much if they're mismatched. It worked fine. I started today with even a Mulkis. So I had two big flies on the leader. But uh, now when changing to a smaller one, it made just much more sense. I have super good confidence in it now, of course, after I caught a, caught a sea trot on it. So it feels awesome. Yeah, oh, I had to take. Yeah. No, that was, oh, that was big. Oh, no. It first tapped and then I had it on. I just saw the shimmery side in the water after I lost it. The number one mistake you can do now is that you overweight the area. You need to be careful now and stay in, have patience. The worst thing you can do is to spook the sea trout that are here. They're here for a reason. So I'm just staying shallow. Keep casting at the area that I had the strikes. There we go. Good take. On the Gamorus again. Oh. <laughs> yes, right in the wave. <laughs> yes. That did the hardest strike I had in a long time. Gamorus again. I have... Uh, Lost the uh, by far biggest fish today, but this is the biggest landed. Again, a cromer on the gamarus. So these small flies should not be neglected. They are awesome. For Simon, the day started without any contact but his mood was still up from a big catch the day before. Without any camera that time though, so it was time for a revenge. Trying several spots, we knew that it was just a matter of time before we get into contact with more fish. Measuring only two degrees in the water somehow made us fight even harder. With most of the fishing culture around the country focused on ice fishing at this time of year, we feel very privileged being able to fly fish in open water. Come on! Oh, 
Fucking yeah, bloody Är det samma fluga eller? De har jag sagt att nej, de här funkar inte. Ja, exakt. Ta We have switched to a new area and it just looks tremendous. Simon had one on and uh, he's fishing shallower than me. I'm going out in the, in the surf. So hopefully there is fish for both of us, but it, we're kind of working together covering both the shallow and the and further out in the waves. Out in the waves my job to cover the most water and I'm doing so with quite a big fish big, big bait fish so it shows also having a gamarus still since I caught two on it that remains oh. We actually have warmer water here, which is fantastic. So three degrees. We found it when we went to the really deep areas where the current is strong and there is no shallow water standing still here. It's always uh, circulated, so you get in Fresh water from further out, which is at this time of year, it's warmer. Oh, I am sort of uh, feeling done with the winter sea trout fishing for a while now. I have uh, a couple of weeks until I go for uh, tropical fishing, which I look so much forward to. And I'm having a bit of a cold right now. <laughs> so I'm probably gonna rest for for the remaining time preparing with fly tying and so on before my trip. Whew, I can barely speak. <laughs> so I am so so happy for Simon that uh, he managed to catch this uh, nice sea trout today. Chrome silver, so we're stoked about that. We had a day, a couple of days ago as well, where he had really poor fishing with no contacts. I, although, had an awesome day, so. And thank you so much for following me during this winter season. And look forward to new, new adventures. <laughs> <laughs> Hello! Hi man! A small groomer here. Ah, oh, sweet. Nice evening, man. Nice, yeah. Still have, what, 20 minutes left? Probably. Might do some cast as well. So one more from today, it doesn't stop uh, biting, so I guess I'll head out and cast a little bit myself as well. Go in here, I got up some worms in my toes again, so perhaps I'll give it a go.
Team on! That's a nice one! Oh god! Solid fish! <laughs> oh, makes so big head shakes! It took on the bait fish fly, had a nag first, and then it took properly. Keep on casting, I'll net it myself! Keep casting, I netted myself. I don't know how big this is. I'm trying to keep the rod out of my arm out of the way. Oh, it's a nice one. Nice silver. Whoa. I'm starting to regret that I didn't take up with this. This is big and it's just mean. Yes! <laughs> oh yeah! Oh, I was almost swearing in Swedish there. <laughs> That's nice! <laughs> what a trout! So incredible. I already gave in, given up, but then you had one on or landed one. Yeah, I got a small one and then I had a nice tug out here. Yeah, <laughs> so I gathered some strength again and so happy I did. Look at that fin. That's a nice one. Oh. We need to measure this one. What a solid beauty. Look at the, the fins are like glass. Amazing. And it's rock hard. There. Come and have a look at this. Like a Titan dub, flash tail, bait fish kind of thing. Pretty big. Incredible, I'll just hold it here in the water, you can come close. What a beauty. Three degrees in the water, terribly cold. <laughs> oh, that is cold now. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Thanks for helping with the motivation to keep on going, Simon. <laughs> I would have stopped for long ago. <laughs> Good on, amazing, mate. amazing. Now I definitely feel done, but it's so much what a fishing friend means. To give some extra motivation to keep going and uh, manage to catch this fantastic sea trout to end the day and perhaps the entire winter season of sea trout fishing for me. But uh, I published lots of them. Uh, one day, Additional, I filmed when Simon was with me. Really fun day. I think you should check it out. So, see you over there. <laughs>